are newspapers, okay? These are newspapers from the Honolulu, Honolulu Star Bulletin. Nearly everybody in Honolulu reads the bulletin. So right here it says, Germans quit. I kind of like that. That's kind of informal. Not, not that we, uh, you know, surrender or anything. They quit. Just like that. And I hope we not see them anymore. But uh, unconditional threat at Eisenhower's God bless Ike. And a whole bunch of newspapers from uh, that FDR trip here revealed, okay? FDR came over there and Roosevelt made a trip over to Hawaii. That was uh, to meet with uh, Japan uh, people and try to uh, put it. Allies push uh, past uh, the Marne. Okay, get, that's a river in, uh, in France. Okay, so they were keeping up with the European news there, too. Extra, extra, the Honolulu Advertiser. Uh, invasion starts, okay. They just, uh, uh, we just had uh, other ones from the, uh, the bulletin that says the invasion starts. This is when uh, we landed on D-Day. Do they call it D-Day here? No. Let's see. Uh, oh, no! Roosevelt dies at Warm Springs, Georgia. All right, Roosevelt died at Warm Springs. He was uh, down there because he had, they don't know if it was polio. They think it was some kind of other illness. But he started a place down in Warm Springs, Georgia, where uh, people who were uh, with uh, polio and other similar things could go down and it was like a, a spa sort of relief where they were treated real well. And he was down there, but he was down there with his girlfriend and his wife found out. And then uh, Harry S. Truman, I'm from Missouri, show me. And right here, Hawaii. Hello, There's no gambling in Hawaii. There's no gambling of any kind in Hawaii. That's why there's a lot of business between Hawaii and Las Vegas, because they're, they're crazy for it. Here's the Chinese news, the outstanding uh, Chinese daily paper in Hawaii. And uh, these are all characters and everything. There's a big population of uh, Asian there in Hawaii. And uh, right here in the uh, Chinese paper, they're looking after the war orphans, the or orphans over there in Europe. So that's kind of a, a big trip for that. Let's see. Tokyo Target, okay? The Doolittle Raid. The Doolittle Raid, uh, we showed the Japanese a taste of their own medicine by flying over uh, Tokyo, dropping bombs, and then they had to ditch the planes because they couldn't uh, turn around and come back, not enough fuel. They ditched the planes in China and went on to a uh, went on to bomb Tokyo and uh, get out. That was known as the Doolittle Raid. Now this is one of the favorite things that I have. Okay, this is one of my favorite things altogether. This is uh, this is a, a flyer that they would hand out. All right, let me maybe take it out of its sleeve here. And this was to announce, okay, the USO show. I, I'm just, I just love it so much. A uh, Mr. Bob Hope, okay? Bob Hope, as we know, uh, I mean, he was back there during World War I doing uh, army bases and uh, actually coming over there to uh, Pearl Harbor uh, after, the, uh, after, the inv after the attack. And here he is, uh, personal appearance by Bob Hope, number one, America's funny man, okay? Aloha, folks. I wonder if he's saying hello or goodbye there. Aloha, folks. This is Bob G.I. Hula Hope. Okay? Bob G.I. Hula Hope. That's what he would say. But along with him is uh, Professor Jerry Colonna. Jerry Colonna, you know the guy with the big mustache who would go, yeah! yeah like almost a Joey Brown, but he was uh, very fun. His mustache, his smile, his eyes all came with him. Uh, Francis Langford, Francis Langford, a great, great singer, okay? A torch singer uh, for 
for forever and uh, very popular during the World War. And she was with uh, she was with Bob a lot, going to those uh, different bases. Sometimes they would entertain two or three guys only, you know. But they had to, they did it, you know. They would go into desolate places. They would get fired at. But this is a. Uh, and the uh, Air Force Band, music by the Air Force Band, Friday, July 14, 1944. So uh, that has been my little Hawaiian trip. And I want to say, uh, as we say in Hawaii, uh, Don Ho. No, we don't say Don Ho. Don, uh, we say Aloha.